everybody and welcome to another adventure of Buffalo Chris Prospect. You guys have probably been wondering where I've been. I'm going to show you guys. So just give me a second here. And now this is in the garage, but stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. I know my garage videos aren't that great, but today we got some Heidi and Conan pay dirt. I got some John Wolf pay dirt and I got some Gold Bay pay dirt that I got for my birthday. My birthday's here in a couple days, April 20th, 420 birthday. So let me show you guys for a minute here what we've been up to, though. So the reason we haven't been out prospecting is because the wife wants a new bathroom. So we've got a new tub. I've torn out the floor and put in the new floor here. I've torn out the drywall. I've been putting in new drywall. I'm still going to yank this old toilet out here and put new drywall in a brand new toilet. we got a new surround coming in new water heater plumber's been here putting all this new plumbing here so now i can get in here and put new drywall that's why we haven't been out prospecting i know it kind of sucks that's where i really would rather be i wouldn't want to do this stuff man i build houses all day long out in the rain sun and snow so let me get at it we're going to get a little gold for you guys stay tuned don't give up on us we will be out, back out prospecting real soon so let me get this set up here and we'll get going on some gold and so first I think we're gonna start out with the Heidi and Conan I like the spaceman on the front of it that's super cool Heidi and Conan they are always in a great mood cool people if you ask me so we're gonna start off with this So first thing when I open it up here there's a pretty cool quarter I don't know what year it is but it's got uh, it says 1776 through 1976. So I believe this is a 1976 and that's pretty cool. We're gonna get this material. It smells pretty good. Pour it in here. And get it classified down. Bigs and small. So let me get what I got going on here and we'll get back at you guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and pan out the bigs and I already seen something in there that blew my mind, Heidi and Conan. I cannot believe that. You must have thrown that in there for Kirk. Kirk is where I got this from. Kirk over there at the Secret Creek. Okay, I'm gonna get these bigs fanned out here. Okay, the only thing I'm seeing in the bigs here is this nugget right here. I can't believe that, Heidi and Conan. Let's get you guys a close up on that bucking horse. That's a bucking horse if I ever seen one. Look at that. Heidi and Conan. Jesus Murphy, guys. That's a bad, bad pony right there. I'll get that on the scale here in a little while. That's a bucking horse. Okay, I'm gonna get air bubbles brushed out of here. Get my pitch adjusted to where I believe it should be. That's looking pretty good. And then I think today I'm gonna use this Idaho spoon. See the little gold panner there on the top? Skippy the Townie sent me that. So I'm gonna get this started here. We're going to get our very first scoop put in there. Let's see what we got. Holy smokes. Heidi and Conan, you crazy bucking horse cowboys. This is buck wild. There's the first two scoops. Holy smokes, you guys. Holy smokes, Heidi and Conan. Let me get this going here. Let me show you guys what we got on the very first scoop here. First two scoops. I mean, this is Murphy. This is Buck Wild. Let me get the rest of this spoon through here and we'll see what we got going on. Might have to turn that up a little bit. Get everything broiling around in there. This VDR is great, too. I can't believe it. Maybe that's up a little too high. We'll turn that down a little bit. I feel like I got the right amount of pitch. Now I took advice from Jason over there at Flower Gold Wizard and I took 
about eight inches off the end of this thing because you know you got a point. The gold don't ever go past here, and that's just all extra stuff you got to clean up. So I'm gonna finish spooning this through. It's looking excellent. I can't believe it. Heidi and Conan, you guys really outdid yourselves. Tell you what. So I don't know if the smile on my face could get any bigger. Heidi and Conan, you son of a buck, and Kirk, you guys, I, you, you bucking horse, I'll tell you what, I'm going to flip you guys around. So you can see, we got good gold in there, and, and I had it running fast trying to clean out the rest of this stuff here, and it's, it's going on the slow side right now, but it's rolling around, you can see another chunk down in there, pardon my working hands, I've been grinding at it hard, you guys, but... We're gonna get this, I'm gonna speed it up, let it clean itself out. I'll get that panned out and get her on the scales and let you guys know what we got. So the first thing I wanna say is thank you, Jason, for the little tip on taking the end of that off because it worked really well. And uh, we, we had no gold loss. We had great gold recovery and a lot less concentrates to deal with. So I got that in the pan. Let me flip you guys around. We'll see what we got going. Okay, so I got that all dried up. Let's get you guys a good look at it. We got a big, juicy nugget. Nice, chunky pieces. Nice pieces. So let's take that over there. Let's get one more look in on them. So let's take that over there to the scale and see what she said. So let's start off with the nice nugget here. 1.46, yeehaw! Heidi and Conan, you, ooh, I almost knocked that over. So let's get that off of there. Sorry about my busted up hands, you guys. We're construction. So let's get this on there. Ooh, my finger's in the way. Get that teared out. Let me get the rest of that tapped on there. Hold on. So right there we got 0.13. Let's put that nugget on there. For a total of a gram and a half. That's pretty good, over a gram and a half, so that's a good bag in my book. All right, everybody, so that's what's going on here. We're remodeling the dang bathroom. We ain't been able to get out, but here in a couple weeks, we'll be back out there hitting it hard. The great news is we got our dredging permits all in order for this year. July 1st, we'll be out there dredging. And here in just a couple weeks, we'll be back up there sluicing. So thanks for watching, you guys.